so welcome back to another video in this video I'm gonna be um, demonstrating how to freehand draw a uh, sofa or a seat cushion seat uh, which for one one seat seater and um, so the very first thing that we need to do is to make a box uh, which is roughly about which is exactly one meter by one meter so um, I'm eyeing this out to look like a cube which is one meter by one meter by one meter here I'm xing the, those lines which I meant be, uh, I don't mean because uh, it doesn't look like a cube that is proportioned and these things need to look like a square on each side surface so I'm xing those instead of just erasing so that you could see exactly what I'm trying to do here and here I'm doing an extra version of the cube so that you could see through and this is uh, useful when you're trying to plot things uh, more proportioned um, so I'm trying to draw, to, to draw uh, roughly three of them of exact uh, cubes and this is a useful framework here i'm doing another correction there it has to look like a square in perspective on each of the surface so if i don't see that it's uh, a square i have to make some adjustments here again i'm doing the exact uh, uh, see-through by wireframing because that's the use most useful so I'm doing my third one here already and here does that look like a square yes so I'm, I'm proceeding on I'm using the same um, vanishing point uh, along uh, disappearing to the y uh, along the y-axis of these things so this is the uh, sofa's um, or the seat's uh, dimensions. So you could see, uh, you could just put in still and you could see it properly the um, dimensions. So it's roughly roughly around uh, above and, and more than one meter in, in each one, on uh, each uh, uh, in particular dimension. So it has a width of one meter by with a depth of 0.9 and a height of 1.1 so not exactly a 1 by 1 by 1 meter so here I'm trying to determine the <clears throat> the 1 meter 1.1 meter plus by way of proportioning so I deciphered from the 0.75 level to the 1 meter and half that that would give me about 1.125 so I use that dimension to go above slightly down the, uh, or less than that uh, above the 1 meter mark so that gives me the 1.1 meter height and here I'm trying to uh, determine the 0.9 meters of depth and here I go so, I'm, I'm so it's not exactly pretty because that's not the point of this exercise the point of this exercise is is to really sketch out in proportion the sofa you could you could print uh, do a prettier drawing later on but here you go so I'm determining a point two width of that arm press and it's if I know where point 25 is and it's slightly lesser than that and that gives me the point two meter width of that so so the height now and I'm determining that the uh, it's 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 really there. I mean here now I'm trying to determine the 0.1 meter um, raise height of the bottom part of the of this. So the arm surface is 0.2 meters above the 0.5 level of the sitting area square or sitting area here I'm try, trying to 
match the height of that armrest. There you go. So I'm thickening my pen now so that you could actually see what what my exact intentions of these um, pocket edges. So uh, that's 0.5. So now I'm determining the the depth of that 0.6 meter um, cushion that I need. So by way of proportioning it, and I can determine that as my 0.6 meter, and then I'm just gonna transcend that there. And that's the edge of that 0.5 meter. Yes, 0.5 meter seating uh, level. <clears throat> so that's the back cushion. That's the top cushion of that seat. seat area that's the arms rest so it has to go up all the way so I'm trying to decipher and think through now this takes uh, a bit of practice in determining uh, where things are and disappearing to that vanishing point and now I'm trying to determine where the back edge is. That's the point nine that I determined. Oh, that edge actually is wrong on the upper right of the cushion. So uh, I only realized now that uh, I made a mistake there. So take note, please. So it's supposed to go up with that corner of that right um arms rest and here that's not where they it's supposed to rest it's supposed to rest a bit more behind than that so do take note that I made a mistake there on the upper right corner of that back cushion so that's where that's not where it's supposed to be right there I'm trying okay. that's not where the edge is supposed to be and now I'm trying to determine the, uh, I'm just locking the edges of, the main edges of the seat. Putting in where the level of 0.5, um, where the uh, lower cushion is, edge, that removable square. And there you go. With that slight mistake, please do take note to correct that when you're trying to do this. Um, so basically, this is it. Uh, uh, hope, hopefully, you learned something. And I guess uh, that's it. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. See you in the next one.